How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here, playing some Brawlhalla for you today as always, and it's a super special day because we have not only a new legend, Tezka, we also have a new weapon, Battle Boots, and we don't get a new weapon very often, so this is pretty big, uh, pretty big news for Brawlhalla. Um, I did buy one of the skins, these are the other two if you're interested. Uh, the one that I did buy, he kind of looks like an Aztec warrior, see what I mean? Ocelotl Tezka? Um, I do have some of these colors unlocked if you want to see what they look like, but yeah, we're gonna jump right into some 1v1 games because that's what I've been dying to do since I saw the battle boots. I'm not gonna go over like what every single move does. If you want me to make like a training or tutorial video on how to use battle boots, go ahead and let me know in the comments. But this video, I'm just gonna be playing some games and I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, because there's actually a lot that you can uh, do with the battle boots and I'm not an expert on it yet uh, myself so kind of just learning as we go and uh, because of that you know you never know what's gonna happen in a way but yeah these boots like if I had to compare them to another weapon I don't even know guys they're kind of like a cross between gauntlets and katars uh, the ground pound is steerable like the gauntlets on battle boots uh, but it slaps like Katars and a lot of the like the the down air on battle boots kind of has the same angle as Katars down air see what I mean So it's pretty cool. It's pretty fun The thing with the battle boots is there's like a million active inputs and uh, it almost feels a little bit like button spammy to be playing battle boots, but that's probably just because I don't know what I'm doing, you know what I mean? And if you do just button spam, you're probably going to be able to do some amazing stuff. That's a down sig on battle boots. It's actually pretty cool because if you hit the battle, oh, he got me. Nice kill. If you hit the down sig and hold down. He'll actually do like a spike instead of a reversal hit, so. How did he hit me? We both did the same thing. Yoink! That's a side sig on gauntlets. If you don't hold forward, like I held forward right there, but if you don't, it'll just throw him backwards. Like that. That's a down sig on gauntlets. I'll do it again. It's a little bit steerable, but not too much. That's pretty cool. I actually hit a lot with the down sig. You'd be surprised. Because people just, if they like to stock, stack on you, it hits so easily. Okay, nice, nice. <laughs> that he got me. Oh, wait, I'm on final stock? Okay, we're gonna have to uh, kick some butt here. Literally, with our boots. Bye bye. Let's see if I can get that comeback win, baby. Oh, that's game. Good game, dude. Good game. Rematch? Let's get a rematch, baby. I'm just getting warmed up. Yo, I did more damage by over 100 and still lost because of that gimp he got me on my first stock. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Those gimps are just so good. Uh, let's go Code Alliance. This time I'm going to do Asgardian Battle Boots. And then for the gauntlets, let's use Regulus. So, I'm trying to get level 25 with every legend. I mean, I already did many times, but now I gotta get level 25 with Tezka so we can get black colors. I got a feeling it's gonna look amazing. I did get the Skyforge boots, which is what he's wearing as well. I don't have the Goldforge though. Gonna have to save up some glory for those. 
One thing I will say about Tezka though, when he has the boots equipped, it's kind of like hard to tell. Oh, I love that one. How did I not hit? Pretty good at hitting uh, neutral, or I mean recovery. Ooh, I love that move. I even thought I held down, but it didn't actually do the uh, the spike. Oh well. Oh, that's good. Sheesh, I got destroyed on that one. <laughs> But I'm still in the lead because he's not going to gimp us again, right? That was pretty cool. If you guys see something like really cool that somebody else does with the battle boots, Always try to uh, learn from it, you know what I mean? You can always learn how to do some of these amazing strings just by watching what they do. <laughs> Let's go. I, I really need a lot of practice with Tesca though, like, okay. Sometimes I do like things and I don't know how I did not hit, you know what I mean? Okay, the gauntlet down sig is so good. It looks like it would be bad, but it's actually so good. I hit with it more than any other sig on Tesca. See what I mean? It just sucks them in and spits it out. Let's go, Tesca. Okay, that was cool. Spin him around, send him flying. I can do that too, bro. GG, dude, GG. All right, best out of three. Best out of three. What, no, no GG? Yeah, there it is. <laughs> All right, this time, guys, Sky Forged Battle Boots. Hmm, hmm. Whenever a new weapon comes out, I always feel like I'm a complete noob again. Like it takes, I know it takes like, it takes a long time to master a weapon. But you know, when you've been a master at weapons for a long time, a new one comes out, I feel like a total noob again, Three, two, which is, one, it feels good and bad at the same time. <laughs> All right, let's go. Cause I, I know I'm making lots of bad decisions and uh, you just gotta learn from them. You know what I mean? I feel like I should be using the ground pound a little bit more. It's like a really good move because you can steer it, especially. Oh my goodness. I did recovery, which, you know, I'm throwing out like kicks while I'm doing the recovery, but he still broke it. Bye bye, let's go! We got that gimp and he was like destroying us too. That might be the difference in the game. Oh, 
thank you. If he would have actually held down, he would have killed me. I feel like the, uh, the down air is, like, bad. I don't know. Come get some, come get some sh GG. Oh, literally. <laughs> well played, dude, well played. We won the best of three, let's go. See, we lost the first match and then we won the next two. All right, um, let's do a couple more games at least. Let's do Esports V2. I'm gonna keep Skyforge boots. I think they look cool. I use regulus? Uh, oh well, let's just use regulus again. Uh, as far as the stances go, I only have speed stance and defense, so I couldn't tell you on the other ones, but, uh, you know, I kind of just like base. I think he has really good base stats. All right, going against another Tezka. Here's a question. Do you think I'll go against anything but Tezka today? <laughs> I actually did go against a couple others, but that was when I, before I was recording, I was just playing around. All right, here we go. Tuska versus Tuska again. If you guys enjoyed the video, please go ahead and drop a like. I'm gonna be playing some more Tuska, maybe in ranked uh, in the future. So it's just a matter of like memorizing the moves, but also like where the enemy is gonna land after you hit him with the move. Boom! Good old side heavy kick. Nothing fancy, but it gets the job done. I love that down stick on gauntlets. It's literally OP. Especially because you can steer it like back and forth. Ouch. <laughs> what do you guys think? Is Tesco OP? I don't know. I don't think he is. I think I could kick some Tesco butt if I had a legend I was like confident with I am definitely not confident with Tesca but he is fun oof it's it's like he doesn't have a lot of good kill options for light attacks with with the battle boots but uh, the signatures and then like the gauntlet, uh, the light attacks, I would say side air with the uh, battle boots. If you hold the side air, it's pretty good. Wow. That's game. GG, dude, GG. Let's see if he wants a rematch. We're starting to get like warmed up with Tezka. Rematch or nah? Oh, okay. I guess not. Uh, GG though, dude. Well played. Let's do the same thing, but different gauntlets. Dark Heart Grasp. Those look pretty cool. If you guys would like me to create like a Battle Boots guide on like how to do some basic combos or strings um, and just like general strategy, go ahead and let me know. If enough people ask, I will make that Three, video. Two. I'm not like a pro on it myself, but I, I can learn enough and then show you guys. You know what I mean? Who am I going against? Firefly? Alright. For some reason, 
He threw away his weapon. Oh, how did I not hit with that? Come on. Bruh. Oh. Oh! -ho! Like a true wrestler, man. I don't need a weapon. Oof. Oof. Should have seen that coming. Nice move, nice move. Firefly. It's kind of a cool name. Gotcha. Oh, -ho -ho! the down sig is crazy off stage. Let's go. Oh no, 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 no. That's a, when you hit with the recovery, all three hits, it's, it's what it sounds like you're saying no, no, no. Okay, okay, come get it, come get it. You trying to do that? GG dude, GG, well played. All right guys, well that's gonna be it for my very first Tezka video. What do you guys think? Should I play ranked 1v1 with Tezka? <laughs> Probably a bad idea, but you never know. Uh, let me know if you want me to play ranked or make a guide or just keep on making some more Tezka videos in in general or never play Tezka again, you know? <laughs> let me know what you guys think. Uh, and as always, this is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.